to another weekend vlog. Two for two, baby. Two for two. As you could see earlier, I already did my morning routine. It is 12.23 now. I went and had a nice workout class. Well, it was so-so, but it was fine. It was spin class, nothing too crazy. <clears throat> so I worked out. And then what else did I do? <laughs> I came home. I walked the dogs already this morning because I have a hair appointment today at 2 p.m. So I'm getting ready for that now. I literally cannot wait. I feel like I need my hair done so bad. I'm just sick of it currently. I got it like lightened like probably almost a year ago I put some brown in it I think last like last November so it's almost been a year and I'm just kind of over it now I am ready for my stark black hair to come back and I don't know if you can tell but my roots are coming through and they're a lot darker than my hair and yeah I'm just sick of it I need it gone I need black back to black so I'm gonna get it colored just black so nothing too crazy and then get it cut because I have such long hair right now. I'm going to get it cut to here. <laughs> Just kidding. But I am going to get my bangs back, go back with fringe and layers. That's the plan. So I'm excited. I can't wait. Now I'm just going to be getting ready. Fix this face up. I'm just feeling so body dysmorphia. <laughs> Yes, I just hate putting clothes on one so that already put me in a bad mood because like nothing fits me obviously and it's just so like frustrating because I want to look cute but how can I look cute if I have nothing that fits me I'm lacking confidence because my face is just getting so chunky and like you can see these circles the hollowness of my eyes so much more and I just look like I have like a ring around my eyeballs and it drives me crazy. And even when I put makeup on it, you can still see because it's like a cliff. <laughs> I need under eye filler. I'm actually starting to contemplate it now because I'm just like, these under eyes, I don't know what's going on. But it also doesn't help because I have like slight discoloration on my under eyes from, I guess, being pregnant pregnancy mask but yeah I'm just not feeling myself today it happens but hopefully after I get my hair done I'll feel better and then once I put some makeup on we have good days we have bad days <laughs> but I'm excited to show you guys my hair transformation it's not really gonna be that dramatic but I am excited to show you so stay tuned stay tuned for that we have an exciting weekend this weekend. Very busy weekend. So I'm excited to take you guys along for another weekend in our life. So here's the before hair appointment. It's very brown. And then like in the natural light you can really tell. And like I'm just ready to go back to black. So before, after, I love it. Oh, it feels so good to get your hair done and just having it back to black obsessed I didn't really get any fringe it's kind of just like a curtain bang which I'm not mad about it I think it still looks gorgeous but um I'm scared to speak up sometimes <laughs> and yeah so it's kind of just like a curtain bang but it's okay I still 10 out of 10 love it feeling much better baby you have a brand new wife we'll eat a yeah, brand new wife. What do you think? I like it. I That's like it. it. I what am I supposed to say? Oh my god! Yeah, wow, that looks so good. You look so freaking sexy. I like it. <laughs> Phone? No. Are you the keys? I gave them to you already. How you done, huh? You vlogging this weekend? Yep. Another weekend vlog. Right, go. Vlog. We made it. I <laughs> <laughs> to the Ramstein Bazaar. Is that what it's called? The Bazaar. Bazaar. The Bazaar. 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 Basically, we're going to get some food, walk around the shops. What is it? Yeah, I'm going to just call that that. Probably not buy anything, but we're really here for the food. That's about it. <laughs> yeah, that's for the cameo. What's up? 
<laughs> AG on the trap. All right, let's go. I can't breathe. What's new? What's new? We ate some food. I'm full. I'm so full. I ended up getting, what was that? Short rib? Short rib and fried, fried rice. rice. And my, now my burps are the worst I could ever have. And we actually bought something. Last year we didn't buy anything, but this year we did. Dun dun dun. We bought da, da, da. a wax warmer. A 220 wax warmer. So we have a wax warmer currently over there, but it's um, 120. Is that the right one? 110. 110. Yeah, so basically it doesn't get to stay on because Without it's, a transformer. Yeah, because it's on a transformer. So we decided to um, get a little 221. And watch some handball. And see how that one works. And, and we got a little scent to go with it. We got hot apple pie. Josh says it's good. You guys want to smell it? I'll smell it. Mama, you want to smell? Move yeah. it. You want to smell it? Too strong? You want to smell it, Mama? <laughs> that doesn't smell like food, I guess. So which, what is cool about this is you can either spoon it and put it in the top tier of this. I can bring it out. Let me see. Okay. Move it, Bubba. You can put it in the top tier of the wax warmer or you can remove the top tier and just set this on it entirely and it will melt. And he says it lasts up to a hundred hours. So this is like the- Which is like nothing if you run it all day. Yeah. It's like four days. So basically, here's the warmer. And then you spoon it out, put it in there. Yeah, you put it in the bowl if you want to spoon it out or you just set it on there and it melts. So I thought that was pretty cool. I think it'll be nice. It'll help our house not smell like dog. And then once you're done with the pot, obviously you can just American. put regular. These are all American. Probably. You can put regular um, scentsies in there. But it'll be nice not to have to worry about it being on transformer. But yeah, that was our day. You use those wax melts that we got. That was my Friday. I took you guys along with me all day. Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna unwind and relax because I am beat. Look at my rings. Look at what I did today. Can you see them? 3,000 <laughs> calories. 837 on my move, move ring, 91 on my exercise ring, and 11 hours of standing. Lula, Mama. stop pumping. Lula. <laughs> what the heck? Why are heck? you humping Bubba? Why are you humping him? Dogs are going crazy. Why is she just humping him? I don't know. Bubba, get, get her. her. Get her. Do not let her beat you up. Get her. So tomorrow, we have um, early wake up call, 10.30. 10.30? Well, That's I have right. to get ready before them. Because we're going to a wine festival. Move. Not much I can do there. <laughs> but Move. I'm going to be the sober driver, you know? No, I'm not, I'm not going just for that, There's but. Not you. Yeah. We're not gonna have a repeat of last Saturday. I'm getting hammered, boys. <laughs> but yeah, so that's our plan tomorrow. On, so man. that should be fun. Um, I'll bring you guys along, of course. Um, but that is it. That's gonna be it, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. We are up and we are ready to go. Oh, a little breathless. Wearing a dress, because that's all that fits me. You know that, Only thing that fits me. I remember I wore this exact outfit a lot of falls ago, and I wore a belt here to give me some structure, but if I were to wear a belt, it would just be right underneath the, the boobies. So we're just gonna free it and be comfy. It's quite comfy. 
but I definitely don't have any structure. You got shorts on? I have underwear on. That's it? What the heck? My boxer Angel, briefs. What if your butt comes out? Well, they look like shorts. <laughs> <clears throat> but anyways, we're ready for our fall festival. Fall festivity, or not fall festival. Wine, wine festival. festival. Yeah. Wine festival. But I'm giving fall festivities. And the weather outside is gorgeous. Just like that girl right there, that pretty girl, and that pretty girl mama. Every day is about football from here on out. Guarantee football it. Football baby girl. College yeah, football yeah. Saturday. And then yeah, yeah. NFL on Sunday. Right. Lord help us. Lord help That's us right. all. We're on our dog walk. That's right. Our daily dog walk. There's one dog. That's right. Two dog. We can't breathe and do this. Yesterday was a fun-filled day, as you could tell, from the Vine, Vine Festival. Honestly, it wasn't what I was expecting. It was more like a carnival with wine there. I thought there was going to be like a lot of different wines there where you sample them and then drink them, but they just had the same wines throughout the whole festival. But overall, still Hello. nice. It was a little hot. Could have been colder. Hello. Hello. But it was still good. Hello. Now we're just walking the dogs. Today we don't have too much going on. We just have to run a few errands and then later this evening we're gonna go see hot mulligan. mulligan round two baby so i'm super excited about that uh-oh luda's on the prowl she's on her in her little stinky steps i know i want to, I want to see her do it <laughs> no not that hey don't dig get it your nose out. Get let me see mama let me see your face here <gasps> here what'd you do to your nose i'm gonna have to update you guys when we get back in the car because i can't walk and talk <laughs> i'm literally so out of breath so let me give you guys the rundown when we get back hi friends i never gave you that update that i was supposed to give you after a dog walk but currently I'm waiting in the car with the dogs because someone, someone special is getting me something very special and I'll show you guys when he comes in. It's really not that special, but for me it's special. We walked our dogs, we went to the commissary because we're gonna make some beef stew tonight and we just need a couple more ingredients for it. I had to get gas because we're gonna go to Wiesbaden today, which is like an hour and some minutes away. So we need more gas for that and now we're here at the bx getting my special delivery um but yeah that's really it for today though honestly that's the extent of our day we're gonna go home and crush out some studying because both josh and i need to finish well he has to finish his class by like next week i think i don't have to but i want to finish this class by at least the end of september one more for baby boy is here that's about it that's our sunday today nothing too crazy no football for us today josh did say though we have to watch the nfl red zone as we travel 
two bees one in. So I guess we'll do that. Go watch Hot Mulligan, get our little rock on. Thankfully, Josh doesn't work tomorrow. We have a very busy day. We have a lot to gear up for the baby shower. So that's what this week is gonna look like for that. I need to get a dress. We DIY like these arches, like you know, those arches that are trending on TikTok that everybody and their mother has. And I have to paint those. I still need to get last minute bits for the baby shower. And yeah, I really am just over it. <laughs> I hate planning things and events because I don't know, it's just too much stress for me. I don't like doing it and I don't enjoy it. I should have just hired someone to do it for me at this point. But thankfully I have friends that are helping me and it's not all on me because honestly, if it was, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have done one. I swear to God, I would have not because it's not that important to me. <laughs> so we have a busy week ahead, I feel like. You know, like my anxiety, because I'm just such an overthinker and have anxious thoughts pretty much 24 seven. And I always overwhelm myself to the point where I'm just like in the worst mood because I don't think things are gonna get done. And they always do. So I don't know why I stress about it, but I do. And I just need to remind myself that everything will get done. I know it will. Like, and everything will turn out perfectly. Even if it's not perfect, it'll still be good enough. You know what I mean? I'm really showing you guys my true colors in this vlog. First, my horrible confidence that I was having on Friday. And now I feel overwhelmed right now and have like, just a million trillion things going through my mind constantly and it's mainly mainly the baby shower but then also I have the stress of school I just like can't I'm overwhelmed um but yeah like I said everything's gonna be okay I know it. it it will at the end of the day I know it'll be okay it's just hard to have that reminder when you feel like it's impossible to reach you know but anyways that's it i'm still waiting for josh it's taking forever here he comes here he comes here he comes here he comes what are you smiling about special delivery this thing they don't have a thing it's hot oh, my first psl the last time i got a cold brew the pumpkin cream cold brew and got screwed so i've been Be thinking awesome. about this bad boy and i can't wait you gonna burn your lip. Oh, you got no whipped cream on there. Yeah, I didn't know if you wanted that. It's okay. Either or. But yeah, now I'm a happy gal. All those <coughs> anxious thoughts are gone because I'm gonna be concentrating on this for a little bit. <laughs> Look at us being college students. <laughs> Hating life. I hate this class with all of my being. There's just so much information and it's hard to learn it when you don't have it. You're your own teacher, you know? So, it's awful. I'm trying over here. I'm doing the pre-assessment right now and I like don't know any of the questions, so that's fun. Ideally, I wanted to finish this class by September 23rd. That ain't gonna happen, so I'm just gonna shoot for the end of the month and jam pack all this information. Honestly, economics, psh, trash. Hate it, I hate it so much. It's awful. How are you going over there? Huh? How are you getting on? I'm getting all of them. Help. Send help. Cheers, me real quick. Let's see. Well, guys, that's a wrap. <laughs> Look at your daughter. That's a wrap. I'm editing this video. I needed to add an end clip because it just abruptly ended after our concert which was really fun second time was just as good as the first time love hot mulligan they're they're really good um but yeah that was our weekend roundup i hope you guys enjoyed it it was a very busy one and it's been busy today we ran all our errands that we needed to do now we're chilling for a little bit Josh, 
got on the camera today and my camera i'm on my phone right now my vlogging camera literally just shit the bed for some reason but josh got like a photography camera versus like a vlogging camera so i'm just like great love that for me no but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys maybe next weekend no promises but maybe